Welcome back to the Crypto Report, everybody. I'm Crypto Kip. Today, we are going to be talking about Crypto.com. CEO is tweeting, and they are doing a lot of trading competition, supporting quite a few different projects, which is one of the reasons that I do believe you got to keep your eyes on this project in the next bull run. There's a couple things you got to keep into consideration when you're talking about Bitcoin versus altcoins. Everybody is looking for an altcoin rally, but how do you pick the winners? Well, I'd like to talk a little bit about one theory here that I'm going to talk about in this video is people are looking at the price tag of Bitcoin, thinking it's too high, they're going to move to altcoins, but which altcoins are they going to go to? I'd like to argue Crowcoin could be one of those. Just look at the strength of the Crow fam, and we'll talk a little bit more about it in this video. If you like the content, smash up like button, subscribe to the channel. We're doing five videos every single day for you and at 10,000 subscribers. We are giving away $1,000 worth of Bitcoin to one lucky subscriber. So do not miss out on that, folks. And let's take a peek here because the market cap is at one point. To two trillion dollars, which is absolutely spectacular. Bitcoin is number one trending token right now as Bitcoin dominance is up to 47.2%, just under $30,000. Ethereum is moving up to 1920 bucks, which is incredible. You look at Binance is hanging on to its price at 320 bucks, and you look at a competitor of Binance's Kronos at six. 0.8 cents still. I feel like we've just been stuck at 6.8 cents for a while now. People are just getting sick of seeing this price ever since the beginning of the month. We've really been sitting here. Honestly, you go all the way back even to uh, the 11th, the 12th. It's just been really stuck there for a while. I'm going to even go back here. We'll go to the last three months. Look at the sideways and down action. Very, very boring, but I think there's a lot. Look at how sideways this was. All the way back to November, we've basically been just trading flat, which is kind of good. You know, we haven't been crashing miserably. Right now, you look at the pr price of Crow versus Bitcoin. That is going down, but uh, that's just because Bitcoin's going up so much. So one thing I want you guys to think about as we go towards the next bull run is Crypto.com announcing it's supporting the Helium Network's migration. Now, granted, Helium has had some issues, but this is just an example to show that they are trying to support as many projects as possible. So any users that want to use their platform, use their program, stake things, anything like that, can use any token they want. Um, and this is really what they're focusing on. And if you look at their Twitter too, you look at the Twitter, first of all, they have 2.6 million followers, which is an incredible community. And then you look at all these tweets they put out talking about uh, this Ariva Digital, we are happy to let you know Crypto.com Pay mobile app integration has been completed. You can now book your flights with Crypto.com Pay. That's pretty cool. Uh, Web3 Festival here in Hong Kong, they are participating. They're putting out trading competitions, $20,000 worth of push token, uh, which I'm not very familiar with, but you see they are giving away more and more things. Look at all these other things. Trading competitions for Velo, trading competitions for Bone, Gas, Yos. There's so many different things they have going on. And they are supporting the Ethereum Chappella upgrade, uh, which is very good to see that that is coming. So that is scheduled on April 12th, uh, which is today. So they are supporting this here today, guys. This is very, very cool to see. Um, you know, and this is really one I want you guys to remember too. They are top 10 DeFi, total value locked up. So that's incredible. But one thing I want to talk a little bit about to get into the specifics of Crow, um, look, it is an altcoin. And right now, Bitcoin is performing much stronger. Alts and Bitcoin. Look at this article, guys. You know, it, this year started with an altcoin rally, but does it make an altcoin season? How can you tell? Well, look at this article, guys, and read through this if you can. Just go to the Twitter and check it out. But altcoin season refers to a short period of time when the prices of altcoins significantly rise and outperform Bitcoin. Uh, what causes an altcoin season? There are f several factors, but one is decreasing interest in Bitcoin. Uh, this is one thing that is really something that that people are looking to do as the bull market continues. Uh, after a significant upward trend in Bitcoin, the BTC price tends to stabilize and remain high. This can cause market participants to seek short-term returns and possibly sell their Bitcoin and shift to altcoins. Uh, also, the high Bitcoin price can also be prohibitive for new crypto buyers who may choose altcoins instead, which would contribute to a general shift of market cap to non-Bitcoin currencies. This is the biggest one I'm going to say. There's so many other great points in this article. Market caps of top altcoins are on the rise is very interesting to note. Bitcoin is going to continue to go up, but eventually altcoins will keep going. One thing I want you guys to think about, though, is look at the price of Crow. 
it is currently at 0 0.06 cents. I'll tell you from experience, a lot of new traders that come into the crypto market, they see the price tag of Bitcoin and they say, that is way too expensive for me to buy. $30,000 of Bitcoin, I'm going to wait for it to go lower. Matter of fact, I'm going to buy lower cost tokens. Honestly, a lot of people see Ethereum too and they go, $1,900 for an Ethereum, that's too expensive. I don't believe in that kind of thinking, to be honest with you, but I'm just telling you that a lot of investors out there do think that way. Then you start to look at some of these other coins. People like the psychological dollar value. So dollar is a key level. Ripple to a dollar, that's a 2x. Cardano to a dollar, a little over a 2x. Dogecoin to a dollar, that's pretty good, similar to a crow coin gain. Polygon's already at a dollar. Uh, maybe that starts looking at, you know, $10. So start looking at some of these psychological levels. Solana's already at 23 bucks. Polkadot's at six bucks. Start to look at some of these, and I don't see a lot that are at pennies. Shiba Inu, people say, is Shiba Inu going to a cent? Is it going to a dollar? These are the kind of qu questions that investors start asking. Well, look at Crow, which is really one of the lowest, um, you know, it's, it's the closest to a penny, I guess, right? It is 0 0.06 cents. It has so much upside to get to a dollar. I do think this is going to be a coin that a lot of people are going to consider when you start looking at all the partnerships that they have, when you start looking at all the different articles and educational pieces that they're putting out on Twitter, along with all these trading competitions. And when you do look at the awesome details here, you know an altcoin season is coming and people are going to be looking for a lower cost coin than Bitcoin. And I'd like to argue that it is Crow. The CEO of Crypto.com is tweeting out Bitcoin back to 30K. Like and retweet if you bought while well, there was blood on the street. Uh, and I'm going to do this right now, and I'm going to just retweet it out. Uh, and I'm actually going to quote tweet. I'm going to go, sure did, because I was buying the blood in the street. I know that there's a bull run coming. I'm very excited about it. And you should be too. I think there's going to be a lot of things. Uh, this guy even says, however, converted BCTC into Crow. Um, so he really likes Crow that much. I'm not suggesting you do that, but that's in a very interesting strategy there. So a lot of good things to be excited for, guys. Inevitably, a bull run will come. Imagine a Bitcoin at three hundred thousand dollars and a Crow coin at three to five bucks. That is something we might be seeing in the next bull run, especially as things start heating up, guys. Looking at the price of Crow versus Bitcoin, unfortunately, I keep talking about it, but it may have about thirty mm, percent more downside versus Bitcoin, and then hopefully we can hit the bottom of this channel, bounce. No guarantee we'll bounce, but I do think we should and could. Uh, and then we could get a 1,000% gain versus Bitcoin. And Bitcoin is absolutely on a tear. Looking out for a $32,000 Bitcoin here, possibly before the end of the month. Let me know what you guys think in the comments down below. Just know that we are giving away a Loaded Lion NFT worth about 15, 1,600 bucks when we hit 25,000 subscribers on the channel. Just follow the details for this giveaway on Twitter, following us at underscore crypto report. If you are a member on our channel, you get an additional 10 entries for every single month you are a member on the channel towards this giveaway. You'll also get access to our private Discord where you can talk directly with me and Black Sea about everything going on in crypto directly. That's all I got in this one, guys. I'm Crypto Kip. This is the Crypto Report. Don't forget to smash up the like button, subscribe to the channel, and as always, you gotta remember, folks, DCA, HODL. We'll see you in the next one. Thanks, everybody. Have a great night. Got two videos for you right here if you wanna check them out. Peace.